The research, led by Montana State University MSU, and published in Nature Communications, sheds light on how ancient microbes evolved in extreme environments, offering clues about the origins of life on our planet. For more than 20 years, Professor Bill Inskeep, from MSU's Department of Land Resources and Environmental Sciences, has studied microorganisms living in the hot springs of Yellowstone National Park. In this latest study, Inskeep and colleague Mansour Delakic, an associate professor in the Department of Microbiology and Cell Biology, wanted to add to their understanding of how life evolved before and during the Great Oxidation Event, when Earth's atmosphere changed dramatically around 2.4 billion years ago, shifting from almost non-existent levels of oxygen to the 20% oxygen we breathe today. To do this, they examined microbes living in two thermal springs, Conch Spring and Octopus Spring, both located in Yellowstone National Park's Lower Geyser Basin. These sites were chosen because they are similar in many ways, except that Conch Spring has higher levels of oxygen than Octopus Spring. This meant they were able to study two contrasting thermal environments with both low and high levels of oxygen. These microbes live in streamers, thin, thread-like structures that sway in the flowing hot water, much like tiny underwater plants. Although streamers in both springs look similar, the scientists found that they host very different communities of microbes. They discovered that the streamers in Octopus Spring, which has more oxygen, also has a greater diversity of microbial life. Octopus Spring contained approximately 10 populations not seen in Conch Spring and these included additional early evolved bacteria as well as additional archaea, says Inskeep. 